Hey, dude. Want to do stuff? Um, uh, yeah. And we're back. Software instability again. Yep. So we're back with Connor here. RK800. Whoa. That's pretty. Find Amanda. I'm guessing she's over there with the yellow stuff. Is. Probably. Amanda. I got, I got a robot booty call? Maybe. Hello, birds. Goodbye, birds. Fuck, it's pretty out here, isn't it? Uh huh. I'll tell you what, though, like, since we're playing this in the office and we're not on the smart TV right now, yeah. it is not as pretty. Oh, yeah. Like, it could have been a, it could be 10 times prettier if we were playing on the smart TV. Just because of it being 4K and all, but I didn't feel like going back in there. Is that really wearing, like, a shawl? Word. Hello, are you Amanda? Hello, Trusted. Amanda. Connor, it's good to see you. It's good to see me too. <laughs> Congratulations, Connor. Finding that deviant was far from easy. Yeah, I know. I was there. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Ooh. Thank you, Amanda. We've asked the DPD to transfer it to us for further study. It may teach us something about what happened. Okay. The interrogation seemed challenging. What did you think of the deviant? What did you think of the deviant? I think it was Trump tester. It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. Mm -hmm. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new hmm. instructions. Interesting. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of it? I think he's irritable and socially challenged. <laughs> but I also think he used to be a good detective. He's an intriguing character. It's not good statement. Yeah. Unfortunately, you have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Uh, okay. Yeah, I was gonna say I will that. adapt to his personality. It is in oh. the best interest of the investigation so right that I there. avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. Yeah. More he's a drunk detective. Yeah. Which means he's gonna be an asshole there if you millions don't treat him nice. If they become unstable. Be the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype cyber life has oh, ever wow. created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. you okay, so they know about the problem. Mm -hmm. What Curry if he's alright now? There's little time. Maybe. And them creating him is what causes it. Because, mm -hmm. I mean, they made him to help figure out the problem. Poor Anderson. Do not cross the line. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. That's a cute robot. Mm -hmm. That voice sounds familiar, too. Anything else we can do out here? Just curiosity. Not from what it looks like. Hmm. This is just wonderful to play, honestly. Oh, many things to discover. You're still here? I thought your this assignment was over. It's just been extended. Mm -hmm. Hank's gonna be overjoyed to hear that. You were right about that android. It's been quiet in the cell all night. Oh, that's the officer who was uh -huh. yeah. the That's the officer's life we saved. That's essentially what that is. How's his desk at? I don't know, there's a lot more things you could have looked at. 
I know, they're all just desk markings. Ah. Uh, let's read this. Jess. Oh. There's Trent Painter, Comet. Neo symbolism. Oh my. I had to stay in the coming weeks. Nate. Huh. That's interesting. This is interesting. Yeah. Huh. Commission January 2035. Android Cop. I'd watch that show. Mm -hmm. Android Cop. He's on a mission and he already has the directions. Oh, there he is. Guess I'm waiting here. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. <laughs> if we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. Huh. I like the amount of sassy, like, African-American officers that are here. Yeah. I like how he said that, like, the robot cares about waiting for you know, three yeah. hours. <laughs> Not proper he is. Nope, oh, can't do this. Boring. This is Ugh. I love it. Progress the case. Go see if you need it. I guess, yeah, I guess he's going to command his desk. What kind of music he's been listening to? He's hoping he's going to come out of here. Ah. Uh, Knights of the Black Death. Homeboy oh, loves death metal. Hasn't even came out yet. Uh huh. Didn't come out until 2021. 20, Should I call someone? I guess they'll be trying to call him. Call Hank Anderson. Hi, this is Hank. Not here at the moment. Leave a message Whoa. if that's what turns you on, but don't expect me to call back. Beep. <laughs> Not gonna worry about that. Don't figure leaving a message is gonna do much. I'm trying to figure out what kind of person he is, I suppose. Cold copy, trace of the caffeine. Well, that's a copy of this. Bonsai tree. Some dead Japanese maple. Some donuts. Ironic. Anti Android slogans, which means he does not like androids very much, does he? Basketball fan. Does like basketball. Here's at Jimmy's. He was on the drug force. And he's a dog. He was a cop. Pretty good cop. Uh -huh. Not reading all these. He did a lot of drug busts. Pretty good cop. Uh -huh. Really good cop. Oh, yeah. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. No, it's Connor. Hank! In my office. In my office. Oh, it's Connor for now. Ah. <laughs> uh. And you're in, listen. <laughs> I've got ten new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Man, this old ladies losing this their is really a story about robots kind of breaking crap. through their programming now, at this point to, yeah. to actually try to become human. And even homicide. Like Marcus. Like this isn't Pretty just much. cyber life's problem anymore. Hmm. 
It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal Sorry with we're not talking as much to some of this. We just... It's I'm really a jurist. It's, yeah, it's, it's very narrative in the game. Link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. He's, I think you're perfectly actor. qualified for this like, type no, of investigation. Motion. Bullshit! The truth is, um, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the back. He almost always plays a cop so or a military guy. Yeah. 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 Every fucking movie he's in. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your yeah, partner. No fucking way. Well, I need a you, partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. Clancy Brown. You are a police lieutenant. Thank you. you are supposed to do American what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Oh, I, Highlander, okay. Captain oh, Brian Hadley, Hadley. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary report. Because it already looks like a fucking novel. That's good. This conversation troopers. is over. Oh, that's where I know. He does the voice of Lex Luthor. Why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things? Why are you doing this to me? Dr. Neo Cortex on the Crash Bandicoot series. I've yeah. had just about enough of your... Mr. Krabs. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Oh. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work oh. to do. Oh, snap. And he's the voice of Surtur in Thor Ragnarok. Hmm. From Ohio. I'm very pleased to have joined the team. I can assure you I'll do my very Close best... Close the door on your way out. <laughs> That's all I thought was going to yeah. happen. Gotta act like a robot. Can't be Have a robot nice day, Captain. <laughs> hmm. Alright, so I'm supposed to go see the Deviant and I need to check on Hank. Which one first? Hank's there. Yeah. Let's go check on that. Uh, pragma what's pragmatic mean? Uh, pragmatic is actually I'm gonna I'm gonna butcher it uh pragmatic I can't remember what pragmatic dealing with means. things sensibly and realistically so be sensibly. pragmatic listen I know you don't like me but we're going to have to work together we'll both have to make an effort positive or partners uh partners now that we're partners it would be great to get to know each other better Wow, he doesn't like me at all. Not right now, no. Uh, desk? Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. I want right across from him. How serendipitous. Alright, now what? Let me check on the Deviant. Analyze Deviant through files. Mm. I'm gonna check on the deviant eventually. Yeah, it looks like the check on the deviant's like the the main thing, the main goal here. So. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Uh-oh. <laughs> Music? Dog. I feel like his dog might be dead. Oh, you want to get But I'll try it. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hairs on your chair. I like dogs. His dog's dead. Oh What's shit, dog's his dog's made? dead. What's it to you? Sumo. Oh, there we go. I call him Sumo. Aww. I like that name. That's a pretty good name for it. Uh, music. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such. But I'd like to. He's trying, Hank. Probably shouldn't talk about the anti-Android thing, should I? Probably not. Uh, I don't know what, what else to do. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. 
I don't think he likes me. No. Okay, so I can access stuff. Who's Fowler? Uh, I think that was the... Uh, captain? The captain. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah. Yeah. Too long. I didn't piss him off. Uh-uh. Hours? I'm... I feel like I'm pushing it. Maybe. I'm just gonna do my job. Huh. Missing AI. Suspect. Oh, it's like, what's this? His parents. Victim Gordon Lopez. Uh, left him home. Went to work. Came home. Not there. No trace of a break-in. Can't... He may have left without being ordered to. Been attacked by that. Working as a waiter at there. We lunged at him, expecting him to strangle the man before leaving the scene. The owner made the large. Okay. He's been attacked by our android. Trash several rooms in a house before taking flight. They have Marcus's on there First as a destroyed robot. Oh, really? Yeah. Interesting. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. Let's fall asleep. Sorry for all the noise. So I can help cases. it. See if we Actually, I could have helped it. Oh. That's a good way to start that the investigation. What do you think? Dude. Walk over and slap the shit out of him. That would be fucking hilarious. <laughs> Lieutenant, we need it to work. Bam! Right in the mouth. Uh, be direct. You shouldn't let your personal situation hamper the investigation, Lieutenant. You don't know what the hell you're talking about. So why don't you just run your program and shut the fuck up? Mm -hmm. No, no. Feeling Undertale. Be determined. I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Really? Where are you going? Lunch. Bullshit makes me hungry. That shouldn't be true. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. We didn't check on the deviant. No. Crap. Well, in that case, hey everybody, thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing, thanks for stopping by. And we'll hope to see you in the next episode.